In this quick video, I'll show you how to replace the internal battery in your Chevy Silverado key fob. Replacing your battery at home is super easy to do. It will take you under five minutes from start to finish, and the only things you'll need to get it done are a regular flathead screwdriver and one CR2032 battery. If you don't have one of these batteries lying around, or maybe you're not sure even where you can find them, you can go check out the link that I have left in the description. That link will take you over to Amazon where you can find these particular batteries for just a few dollars. One thing to mention, uh, some of you out there might have the three button version of this device where it doesn't have the trunk button and it should look something like that. Um, or maybe even there might be a version without this panic button, but as long as it has this kind of layout with the, the two buttons, the lock and unlock there, little indentation in the back, and it's for the Chevy Silverado, between 2007 and 2013. Doesn't matter which version you have, you can follow this video um, and the process is going to be the same and the battery will be the same as well. And uh, I promise we'll get a new battery in your device again in under five minutes. The first step here is just to find the little slot on the bottom of your key fob. It's right next to where the key ring attaches and right along the seam. There it is right there. Take your flathead screwdriver, insert it in there and just gently wiggle it in. And once it's lodged in there, just give a little twist to your um, flathead. Just turn it like a key, and that will start to open this device up. Okay, now just pull it apart and get. At, and now we have access to the battery. The easiest thing to do from here is actually just lift up this little circuit board here so that we can slide the battery right out, just like that. Now go ahead and dispose of your old battery, grab your new CR2032 battery, and when you're putting it in, make sure it is going positive side up. So you wanna see the plus sign and the battery information facing up when you slide that in there. Just push it all the way in. And now all we need to do is put this thing back together. So grab the front of your device that has the rubber in there, drop the circuit board in, battery facing up, and then just put the back section of plastic on there and squeeze it back together. And just like that, you are done and you have a new battery in your Silverado key fob. Uh, if you found that helpful, feel free to let me know down in the comment section or just by giving this video a like. And if you ever need help with another one of your key fobs, you can come back here. Uh, we've got you covered on this channel with tutorials for the devices of almost every make or model out there. And you can also get that information over at our website, fobbattery.com.